Lobby Tools, legislative news and information systems, on the web at lobbytools.com. Jeffrey Johnston would be 21 years old had bullies not pushed him over the edge. In 2005, the Fort Myer teen took his own life after being picked on for three years. His death changed the way Florida schools handle bullies and their victims. The Jeffrey Johnston Stand Up for All Students Act was signed in 2008. It requires each Florida public school to adopt an anti-bullying policy and gives them some authority to police cyberbullying. Victims of bullying are finding it harder to escape their harassers. Before text messages and social networking websites, solace could be found at home. Now sites like MySpace and Facebook give bullies a forum to create 24-hour teasing sessions where teens are humiliated in public forums. The 2008 law cleared a way for schools to police online teasing if the attacks were sent from school computers. We are showing a film. Representative uh, Michelle Raywinkle Vasilinda is fighting back through a public awareness campaign. We cannot afford one child, one student to be affected by blame. And he started kicking me. To kick things off, Bill Brummel, director of the documentary Bullied, is showing his movie to teachers and students. And I hope uh, administration and faculties um, take the film and see it and also realize the long-term consequences and really work hard to provide a safer school environment. Florida's been praised for its progressive anti-bullying policies. Legislation to offer further protection to students will be discussed later this year. In Tallahassee, I'm Whitney Ray reporting.